is at its limits of what it can do. If I even added a new webcam that used a tiny bit more memory, it would pff, crap everything out. So, being that my webcam's old, my setup's old, I said, this would be the year, right? I can upgrade everything, will be great. That's the whole plan for 2021, is to keep doing these great streams on Twitch, to keep pumping out the quality that I'm doing and improve the quality slowly over the course of the year because I can improve all my hardware setup for the first time in many years because I don't have these financial worries on my back anymore, okay? And, quite frankly, it looked like things were going to be great. If you took a look at early on in the year, you know, things on Twitch were doing really well. I mean, I had upwards of 900 subscribers on Twitch every month for like two, three months straight. The income on Twitch was getting good. Like, it was to the point where, wow, I not only have enough to pay my bills and do all of this stuff, but also I have extra now where every month I could be putting some aside for upgrading the equipment. Maybe, hell, I could save up and within a, a year or two I could go on a nice honeymoon with my wife, which we never got to do when we got married in 2015. You know what I mean? Like, all these things were plans in my head of things that I could do uh, as a result of financially things kind of settling down and getting better for me. All right? And then Twitch kicked me out of the partner program in April for no actual valid reason. There's no legally justifiable reason for them doing it that makes sense. Besides, they just wanted me out because there was some kind of bullshit going on, whether someone at the company for some reason didn't like me, or more likely, because my trolls, as you guys know, all the time, everywhere I go, they massively misreport me as violating rules, doing this, doing that, and because they mis misreport me, mass report me for things I'm not doing, all these companies basically don't want to deal with me. At one point, I was in a partnership with Curse. On YouTube. <laughs>